Hey guys, what's up? It's Matthew Black, and we're back with another Minecraft video. And um, I'm using the nor new Norse mythology texture pack. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm using the new Norse mythology texture pack, and I've got this new skin that looks cool. Right? Right? No. Anyway, we are here with BG Awesome. He's going to help me. BGE Awesome. It's going to help me. And we are going to do the interior for the tavern that I did a long time ago because and I've been switching out these blocks very poorly because I missed these. Anyway, we're doing the interior for this tavern which I built a long time ago because I had a request from one of you to do the interior on it. So, let's do an interior on it. What's this sign say? It says nothing. Help me. Oh, okay. Let's, let's get some water out for you. And... Where's the water? I don't know how this texture pack works. Okay, here we go. And I, I helped you. You're, you're fine now. Okay, anyway. So, let's go inside. And I've already done a little bit. Let me drink a potion of night vision. I've already done a little bit. Like, I did this uh, chandelier, which is really simple. I'm just, it's just three bars across in the center of these windows that are already there. And a bar down. And then you build a plus formation. And then a bar down, and then you bet out to the left and to the right. And you put one and then two up like that. So it looks like that. And then on the very next one down, you go the opposite way with just two out. And then the very next one down, opposite way with just two out. So I'm sure you guys can build that and figure it out. I think it looks awesome. If you want, you can try to do a different chandelier design with in rods or something. Um, this is just what I had built a long time ago. Um, I also did a fireplace which is directly adjacent to the one that's on the outside. So we have our outdoor fireplace from the tutorial. We also can do this indoor fireplace, which is just three blocks across with slabs along the bottom, which I think I'm going to change out to these because it's a different texture pack. Um, and then on the sides, you just do a log, cobblestone, wall, wrap, the stairs around like so, put a torch on the top. Um, everyone should know this trick. It's just simply an item, a torch, an item frame, and a slab like so to get that trick. And there you go. Um, these are the chimneys, by the way, I think. Right? Is that why those are there? Oh, no, they're just those things. Okay, so get to the interior. Um, this little desk right here, if you want, um, it's just... A block space from the door and then a block and then you can build like a little pattern like this a block space from the door and then all I did was full block gate full block slab full block slab full block slab full block slab very 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 simple design to to get that and then I've just put the floor in where the grass is and this texture pack this is jungle but um, you can make it whatever you want so let's uh BGE, let's take um, stairs and try to cover up the ceiling like this with the with the stairs and see if that makes it look a little better in here. It's the first thing we're gonna do. Ah, I fell. So this isn't gonna be a tutorial so much as like a let's build. I'm just gonna let's build the whole thing. So it does look good with the stairs. Um, just go up to the next layer and just put stairs. Don't worry about doing anything crazy. I think I'm going to leave below the window. I'm going to leave that as full blocks, maybe? No, we'll do stairs. Like that. And it looks like this should be a full block. Like that. There we go. Very good. Looks awesome. Okay. And then, like in these little windows areas here, we'll just do stairs that come back and then a corner stair like that. Stars that come back and then a corner stair. There we go. We'll just do that all the way through where we can. On this, it looks like it needs to do that. Stairs that come back and do this. And here, and here. Basically, just take every sharp edge and make it into a stair if we can. Um, then we're just going to do this. Boom, boom, 
Boom, boom, boom. That looks awesome. Alright, other side now. And I know you guys can probably figure out a tutorial uh, interior on your own, but this is just my ideas. I'm just free form thinking, building it on the spot, no planning <laughs> at all. Um, plus, it's fun to use this new texture pack that we have on the PS4, Xbox, console in general. So, one thing is that side's different than that side because we have this, this, uh, beam across instead of what we have on this side. So I did those sides differently. I kind of like that better, so we'll just do that. There we go. And then, on this side... Over here I had, I think, uh, stairs. Okay. So I'll just do put stairs on this side too. There we go. Ta-da! Okay. So next, all you really need to do is put tables and kegs and such in here. So we can build like a little keg here by the door. So let's just build like three blocks out like this and then I don't know how I want to do it actually I think I ought to do it with stone brick stairs and stone brick slab so it's like a stair there and then one two three one two slabs and then a stair there so that's four one stair one two slab and stair and then we'll just do a full block across the top of it, like that. And put an, a stair, upside down stair on it, like this. And can we get a stair in here, an upside down stair? If I aim at the very top of that, there we go, upside down stair like that. And then we'll put full block, full block, full block full block and then right side upstairs and then there we have it there's our keg <laughs> we'll put a little tap on it we'll put the tap down here where we can get to it looks pretty cool I mean it matches the the stuff which is kind of weird but it looks cool what we could do is some ladders on the side of it. And some ladders over here. They give it a little bit of detail. That's a very large cup, sir. <laughs> Alright. Oh, dye it brown. Now that we can dye cauldrons, we can dye the water brown and it'll look like beer. Do it. There we go. Beer coming out the keg. <laughs> Chocolate milk or beer. It's, it's definitely beer. Don't question it. Okay, and then over here we'll do like a more almost like fountain drink design. But we'll try to make it look kind of medieval. So we'll just do a upside down stair. An upside down stair. And bring that out by two. And then take a slab of the same material and putting that across and then get some more night vision looks like we're gonna have to do a lot more on the then we'll put some I don't like the way that looks let's do cobblestone wall there and then we'll put some kegs some little ones let's use oak wood and bring those across and then we'll put hooks on them and then we'll put cups underneath and there we have ourselves like another keg type bar but it's little kegs instead of big kegs and that covers each side of the door just like that now BGE if you'll help me we'll do a table here and here 
that are exactly the same. So I'll build one if you want to build the other. Um, we're basically just going to do piston tables. So what you'll need is a piston and a block of redstone. And then we'll do, for chairs, we'll do um, dark oak chairs. Um... Ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -dum. Blue scoo-doo. Alright. So we'll do tables like that with the pistons. And then I'm just going to do bench seats with dark oak stairs on either side. I don't like the bench seats, so I'm going to take out the middle seat. And then we'll put a dark oak fence gate in between to give it arms like that. There we go. And then we could always put signs on the ends to make it look nice and fancy nope on the side there you go so there's our tables we just put those there and then get a similar one over here and then we can't put tables here because there's doors so it's really like a question of what to put here I don't know to be honest with you so I think I'll definitely do a rug and in this texture pack I really like the lime green for like a medieval like this because it's kind of ugly <laughs> and it looks good so I'll just do a rug there and then we'll do a rug over here that matches and then we could put another table somewhere in the middle somewhere mm -hmm. so we'll just do like from the raw hmm. it needs to be right in the middle like right here so we'll make it three long and it'll be like from the end right here it'll be one block over no nope, make it too long Because I remember there's going to be something right there. So two like this. And then we'll just put a bench on either side. And then we'll do the signs on the sides of the chairs. Come on. Oh, like little chairs like that. That looks nice too. That looks nice too. Let's do that. Signs, signs. There we go. So those are kind of in line. I think yours is one block over. Let's get it one block over. And then just put this chair here. I think. That way, just put chair, tables and chairs is wherever you can make them, I guess, is the best way to do it. And then what we'll do is build the entrance, because um, we had this window covered up in the tutorial, and I like the way it looks from the outside. So let's take dark oak, and let's go up all the way to the ceiling, like that, and just bring that all the way to this entire side here and then what we'll do is take a full block and then fill that gap in and then take a slab and fill that gap in so it looks like that we'll even take a slab and fill that in so there we go so it's a full block a slab and then a slab here so a slab there there we go and then We'll take a full blocks and fill this in, and then we'll take a stair and put it above the door. And that gives you a nice entrance that we can work with from the outside, from the inside. And then on the outside, it covers up that window and looks really nice. Um, that's a little off center, isn't it? <laughs> Strange pictures. 
We'll put some little shelves on each side by using stairs. And then get us a, a centered picture. Is there a picture that's three blocks wide? See what we have that's just uh, two blocks, just one block wide like that. Put, put something in the center. Yeah, you do that, and then I'll put one in the center here. And then we'll see if you can put an opposite one on the opposite side. Not meat hanging. Not fish. Not meat. Not fish. Do you have like a flag? We could just put a banner here. Okay. We'll just put a red banner. I feel OCD. Should it be symmetrical or or should it be asymmetrical like that? Like I have a shield on one side and you have the rune on the other side. You'll have to make it small again. And then we can put like more paintings just around. So like this would be a good place for the bear rug. There we go. And I kind of want the wolf. Or isn't there like a wolf pelt? We'll just do bear rugs on either side because that looks awesome. And then down here by the fire, we'll do the little fishes or a little meat like that. We'll put the other meat over here if we can. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm trying to get. Oh, that looks cool, too. That looks cool. Come on. Okay. Listen here, so, buddy. There we go. And then I wonder if I can put the other... Can I put a painting on a half slab like this? Yep. But it goes the wrong way. There we go. Oh, that looks so cool. But I wish I could hang that off, or, off of it. Like if it was a half slab down, it would hang off of it. Um, nice. <laughs> okay, so let's build like a little rack for something. Let me see. Let's scoot that over. I wonder if I could make... I want the hanging stuff to hang off of something. Like that, I want that to hang off of something. So I need a top slab somewhere. So maybe I'll put it here. We'll build this up. We'll build like this up and then we'll bring it across. Oh, I knew that was gonna delete that. Dang it. Let's see if we can get a bear pelt back there. Or just no. We'll Maybe had not. No, it looks too symmetrical. What'd you do? Did you fix it? Okay, but use the other one. The other painting. It's like hanging fish or something. There we go. Now that looks awesome. Let's see if we can get our bear, bear pelt back. Come on. Oh, oh I deleted it. I hate when that happens. Uh, delete. Oh my. Well, unsubscribe. <laughs> I've deleted the painting that I need twice now. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we have the hanging fish now. Um, we could put maybe the swords by the door or something. Like those little swords that we had. Come on, little swords. Don't make me do this to put you down there there we go so like people are just leaning up their like axes and stuff against the wall when they come in because it's a tavern that's what we do right we lean stuff against the wall as we come in so we'll put another one here the little swords come on little swords and if you don't have this these pictures then this whole part's a waste of time but you know you get the idea of putting something around you could also put crates of stuff like uh books you know, like bookshelf stuff you could put some bookshelves over here 
you know, um, just to fill it in. Um, here we go, bookshelves over here. We also did potted plants on the outside, so you can totally do potted plants in here. Just get like a nice looking, or maybe not a nice looking, just like a, that kind of plant. That looks really cool, I think. All right, what do we think of the interior so far? We need a rug in the middle, right? I wish you could put paintings on the ground. To have like a bearskin rug painting or on the ground. That would look awesome. What do we have? The pink? That doesn't look too bad. So now we need more, we need more lighting. So let's do a torch. And a item frame and a slab. Let's do that above all the doors. So two blocks above each, or you know, second block above each door. Because I know we need more lighting in here. This will look really cool from the outside too because it will light up the windows on these. Um, we could do this whole plant thing, um, beside the doors too, like in this corner right here, you do the whole plant thing. I love the birch leaves in this texture pack because they look like fall leaves or something. There we go. So let's do some lighting over here. We'll put it right there in the center to get that. Put it lighting here in the center to get that. And then... Uh, how much light... Do we have enough lighting? Let's drink some milk. And find out. It's kind of dim in some places. So what you guys could do... Is get out a grass block. Alright. Get out a grass block. Get out a double tall grass. Like this one where is it where's the double tall grass at here it is duh and get out some flint and steel like this grass block double tall grass and then light the top of the flint and steel the grass on fire and then break the bottom of the grass like that so grass block double call double tall grass double, double, double tall grass and then break the bottom of the thing like that and that'll give us some more lighting in those two places where we needed it all right what do you think bge how are we looking are we looking all right put some stuff here some stuff here a couple cups for bars um so we could put bar stools in here there's a few different ways we could do bar stools. Um, there's like literally tons of different ways. The way that I usually do is with instone, but that looks really strange in this texture pack. So you'd have to use some other kind of bar stool. There's the. Um, there's like the armor stand bar stool. Do you know how to do that one? BG? We'll put an armor stand half down like this. It should be even lower than that. So like another half slab down to that. So we need a half slab of some kind. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Drop an armor stand in there. Not a dancing armor stand. Just a regular armor stand. <laughs> and then we'll do creeper heads. But we should face them the other way. Face the armor stands the other way. Man, I'm just all over the place. Here we go. Armor stand. Ah! There's a dancing person. Armor stand. Armor stand. 
armor stand. Creeper head, creeper head, creeper head. Not on the wall. And not a Steve head. Ah, gosh. Creeper head. Here we go, creeper head. Why is that not working? Pain in the butt. Creeper head, creeper head, creeper head. What's this guy doing? Kill it with a fire. Okay. No. <laughs> Alright, and then... If you can help me with this part, BG. All we need to do is have a piston and a block of redstone and then the floor block. And we'll put the floor block there. And we'll put a piston facing downward with a block of redstone. And then put any block there. Like another piston, doesn't matter. And that will do that and make our make our wonderful bar stools. Right? No? Okay. <laughs> so, bar stool. And then some other block. Bar stool. And then you delete it. And ta-da! These are going to be our little seats. Minecraft dab. They did give us dabbing armor stands for no good reason. No good reason whatsoever. All right, here we go. You got one done. <laughs> That's good, right? Okay, here we go. Put, no, don't put that there. Put that there and one more time there we go so I did armor stands stools so now you can sit at the bar like this and they're really cool looking they don't look bad I don't think you could also just use um, you know normal chair stair chairs if you want to be you know boring but yeah guys I think that's in the interior it's pretty much done in here looks good you could change the up top part I don't actually use this part of the building so I would just um, close it up to be honest with you take a full block and close it up it's just the unused part of the building that you can see from the outside so there's the inside and here's the outside so there you go uh, by the way if you guys did build this on ps4 and you're and you like this texture pack this is what it looks like because when we originally built it we built it in the uh natural texture pack i changed out the spruce um roof for a dark oak roof and i traded out the um acacia logs for um whatchamacallit spruce logs it's because things look different in this texture pack so i changed those out and back i put a um, trap door on the bottom of the lanterns because back when we built this you couldn't put trap doors like that so we had slabs on it but now i have trap doors on them so it looks a little bit better and then the inside is done so yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you liked the video leave a like let me know what you think of the um the uh let me know what you think of the interior you're flying and you're on fire because you're in a floating fire very good <laughs> So anyway, let me know what you guys think of the interior, and I'll see you guys next time. Until then, play hard, and bye bye